You get one shot at this. You get one get go. And you're wasting it. You're wasting it at this bullshit nine to five that they told you you need. You're wasting it going to that bullshit college, getting a degree and a piece of paper that don't mean shit. It just tells you that you are a good citizen that's obliging to what we want you to do. Without even thinking, oh, I don't want to do this. Why am I paying this money to go get this education that it's not even really an education? When you could pay that same amount of money, you could buy books and courses. And you'll be in a way better position. You can start your own business, bro. Live life to the fullest, bro. Bro, I remember when I was a kid, I had so many fears. I was afraid to speak to people. That was my biggest fear. I was mute. I literally could not speak to majority of people. If he wasn't my mom, dad, my brother, or one of my close close friends. Like I could not speak to you, bro. It was like a mental prison. Physical prison too. Like even if I wanted to talk, I could not force myself to talk. I had extreme, extreme social anxiety. And I never take no medication and none of that bullshit for it. Because my family, we don't really believe in doctors. And they they don't really view shit as a problem. You know, where we come from, that we're not privileged to have problems like that. They don't have to, they, they don't want to worry about that type of shit. They don't want to worry about paying the bills. But, bruh, imagine if I let that fear take over my life imagine if I never faced that fear if I never forced myself no matter how hard it was just to say something just to start speaking up and I did it little by little what would I be today if I was just this mute shy motherfucker what type of life would I have lived I would be goddamn in the basement not doing shit, playing video games. Fat as hell. And I conquered that fear. You can conquer any fear you have. If I can conquer that shit, bro. If I can crawl out of that shit, bro. And start running and start flying. You can do anything, bro. Stop letting fear stop you from living life to your fullest. Stop worrying. Stop worrying about everything. Start having faith. Start believing. Put the action behind the belief. Stop worrying if that girl is going to like you. Stop worrying if that girl is going to leave you. Stop worrying about you your business failing if you start the business start it bro and believe that it's gonna work and even if you fail it's only temporary keep going go out and go on in an adventure make life an adventure life is meant to be lived not to just be in this mundane cycle of not doing shit of you just sitting around doing the same shit every single day that's not pleasing your soul that doesn't speak to your soul now if you do the same shit every day and it's enlivening your soul then you might be good but a lot of people cannot tell that a lot of people cannot feel if what they're doing is reaching their soul If they're doing things for their soul. But go out and live life. Get experiences. Go do things. 
Go to that different country. If you're watching this, I know you live in the West. Majority of y'all live in the West. Bro, you can travel to pretty much any country and you have the privilege. Go travel. Go meet different people. Go see different cultures. Go do some dope shit. Build you something crazy. Chase your wildest dreams. You can do it, bro. You got that power within you. The most high is with you at all times. You have to tap into this power. You got to really, really know this. You got to really, bruh. You got to tap into your higher self. And you got to live from that. And live in the flow state. Where everything just flows. And you push past the resistance. This is just this is just a message I want to give y'all, bro. Just live life like you're going to die because you're going to die and you don't know what comes after this. We can speculate all day. But you get one chance to live. Now I'm not saying go out here and do a whole bunch of shit from your lower self and get into all these vices and go party it up and go do all these drugs i'm not saying do that because that is not living life to the fullest just seeking pleasure chasing pleasure living life to the fullest is attracting things to you because you're in your highest vibration you're attracting all the good things all the good experiences you're viewing yourself as worthy of all the good. You are worthy of the love, of the success, of the wealth. You have to really feel this within you and live life from that. And every action you take, you say, I'm worthy. Now I'm going to live my life to the fullest. I want you to write a letter to yourself. From you on your deathbed of all the things that you want to accomplish. This should be emotional. You should feel some type of way. Write a letter about all the things you've accomplished. You're about to die. And you're writing this letter. And you're going to get clarity on the direction for your life. And what you actually want to do. What you actually like to do. And go do those things. Go make it happen. It's Zen Hustler. No slave. We out.